the universe. An immense and seemingly desolate expanse. Teases us with fleeting mirages of life that disappear under scrutiny. But within this cosmic wilderness exists an oasis. A vibrant nest of life in myriad forms. This blue speck we call home. Earth stands out. As we pursue extraterrestrial life, it's vital we first uncover the secrets of life that thrive right here on our planet. Life in its astonishing diversity. From the simplest single-celled organisms to complex multicellular beings. Flourishes here. Look closely and you'll find an enlightening truth. Even on Earth, life is confined to a thin, fragile layer, the biosphere. This delicate skin, barely clinging to our planet's surface, extends just a few kilometers above and below. This is where the heartbeat of life resonates. Here, the fundamental elements of life come together, providing sustenance for a myriad of species. To delve into the mysteries of this fragile biosphere. To understand its boundaries, its rhythms, and the strength and adaptability of its inhabitants. Is an essential first step towards conceiving the possibilities of life on distant worlds. Unraveling the complex dance between organic and inorganic elements can prime us for the exploration of life beyond our own solar system. Why, you might ask, is life confined to this thin belt, this biosphere? The answer resides in the unique conditions essential for life to thrive. Among these conditions, water stands supreme. Notably, it must exist in its liquid state. Known as the universal solvent, Water conducts the grand symphony of chemistry that supports life. Its distinctive characteristics are crucial. Its capacity to hold heat mitigates Earth's extreme temperature swings. And as it freezes into ice, it becomes less dense, floating and providing a sanctuary for life beneath its icy veil. Equally critical for the existence of life is a moderate temperature. Life's fundamental building blocks, biomolecules, can't bear either extreme. High temperatures disassemble their structure, whereas temperatures too low can bring metabolic activity to a standstill. The biosphere's temperate climate facilitates the functioning of biological molecules like proteins and nucleic acids. Proteins, instigators of countless biochemical processes, are finely attuned to changes in temperature. DNA, the schematic of life, can undergo irreversible damage at high temperatures, interfering with its ability to replicate. Further, life needs a shield against the unforgiving conditions of space, including harmful cosmic radiation. These high-energy particles present a serious menace, inducing irreparable damage to biomolecules and causing dangerous mutations in DNA. Only within the protective shell of the biosphere, safeguarded by Earth's atmospheric and magnetic fortifications can life prosper. However, these conditions didn't sculpt the biosphere in solitude. Its formation and continuation hinge on a delicate balance between various geological and climatic systems, including water cycles, atmospheric dynamics, and plate tectonics. The harmony between vital elements like carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen is upheld through intricate geochemical cycles engaging the atmosphere, hydrosphere, lithosphere, and biosphere. This fine act of balancing highlights the fragility of life and the biosphere serving as a powerful caution as we commence our quest to discover life beyond our own realm.
Life, in all its resplendent diversity and complexity, adorns the surface of our planet. This richness is the apex of evolutionary processes spread over billions of years. Earth's surface, life sparked into existence and continues to thrive, driven by the sun's energy and abundant water. Life on the surface stands as an affirmation of the complex interaction of solar energy, geology, and evolution. The circle of life, energized by solar power, unravels in full view. Plants, algae, and certain bacteria capture this energy through photosynthesis, producing oxygen indispensable for all aerobic life forms. Herbivores feast on these primary producers, acquiring energy and nutrients, and in turn, become nourishment for predators. Each organism, regardless of its position in the food chain, forms an integral link in this intricate life web. However, life isn't evenly dispersed across Earth's surface. Biodiversity, the tapestry of life, is shaped by numerous factors including sunlight, temperature, rainfall, soil quality, and geography. These factors converge to etch out distinctive habitats, each cradling its unique life forms. For instance, the equatorial region, blessed with abundant sunlight and rainfall, cradles the tropical rainforests. Earth's richest treasure trove of biodiversity. Vibrant with life, these verdant forests house an array of species found nowhere else. In stark contrast, Water-starved deserts paint a drastically different canvas of an apparently lifeless stretch. However, a keen observation reveals robust species designed to withstand extreme conditions. Exhibiting phenomenal resilience and inventiveness. The sprawling grasslands, with their measured rainfall and fertile soil, support a rich variety of plant and animal life. From wildebeest herds roaming the African savannas to bison on the North American prairies. These ecosystems illustrate the harmonious equilibrium of life on Earth's surface. covering 71% of Earth's surface. Our planet's aquatic bodies entertain a breathtaking spectrum of life. From microscopic plankton to gigantic blue whales. The sun's nurturing rays pierce the water's surface, fueling phytoplankton, the keystone of the marine food chain. Delving deeper, a multitude of organisms enliven the aquatic world, each showcasing the astounding diversity of marine life. In the ocean's depths, under tremendous pressure and cloaked in perpetual darkness, life persists in astonishing ways. Harnessing sources of chemical energy, like those found in hydrothermal vents, these organisms challenge our traditional understanding of life's prerequisites. From the freshwater veins of rivers and lakes to the saline expanse of oceans, from the sun-kissed shallows of coral reefs to the frigid, dimly lit trenches, aquatic ecosystems provide a vast panorama of environments. The life forms inhabiting these diverse waters exhibit awe inspiring adaptability, a testament to life's unyielding spirit. This extraordinary range and resilience echo the spectrum of potential life supporting conditions elsewhere in the cosmos. Remarkably, 
Life carves a niche even in Earth's iciest corners, where sunlight is a rarity and the ground is frozen year-round, in the Arctic tundra and Antarctica. Here, mosses, lichens, extremophile microorganisms, diverse plants and animals, migratory birds, and mammals all carve out an existence amid these seemingly hostile conditions. Through delving into the diversity of life on Earth's surface, its distribution, and the environmental factors that shape it, we glean insights into life's or inspiring adaptability. This not only deepens our understanding of life on Earth, but also sheds light on the potential forms life might take under varied conditions elsewhere in the cosmos. Deep beneath Earth's crust, where not a glimmer of sunlight reaches, far from the life forms we're accustomed to, exists an unexpectedly vibrant sphere of life, the subsurface biosphere. This realm, predominantly inhabited by microorganisms like bacteria, archaea, and fungi, has ingeniously adapted to overcome seemingly insurmountable obstacles. A substantial portion of these inhabitants are lithoautotrophs, beings that harness energy not from sunlight but from the very rocks they inhabit. Through a process known as chemosynthesis, they feast on rock minerals, deriving energy through chemical reactions. These creatures thrive in environments of profound darkness, limited oxygen, and high pressure, conditions vastly different from surface life forming diverse microbial communities at depths ranging from 3 to 5 kilometers within the continental crust and up to 10 kilometers in the oceanic crust. These subsurface microbes, far from merely surviving, play pivotal roles in Earth's biogeochemical cycles. Their rock-grinding activities significantly contribute to soil formation and help maintain the balance of essential elements like carbon, nitrogen, and sulfur. Their influence is extensive, impacting surface life and Earth's long-term climate. The existence of this subsurface biosphere broadens our understanding of the thresholds within which life can exist. The realization that life can endure in such extreme environments, devoid of sunlight, reshapes our perceptions of habitability and stokes our imagination about life's potential in similar environments elsewhere in the solar system. Consider, for instance, Jupiter and Saturn's icy moons, Europa and Enceladus. Warmed by tidal heating, these moons are believed to house subsurface oceans. If life can flourish kilometers beneath Earth's crust, could analogous species inhabit these alien oceans? This intriguing question underscores the importance of exploring Earth's subsurface life, unlocking exciting possibilities and propelling the search for life beyond our home planet. Above us. It's not just a layer of gases we call the sky or our planet's atmosphere, but a dynamic and often overlooked frontier, teeming with a multitude of species that spend either a part or their entire lives aloft. The lower strata of the atmosphere primarily house microscopic organisms including bacteria, fungi, and viruses. These microorganisms, referred to as bioaerosols, are swept into the atmosphere by wind, weather events, and human activities. They can travel great distances, aiding in species dispersion and influencing climate. For instance, certain bacteria act as ice nuclei, contributing to cloud formation and precipitation, and occasionally inflicting frost damage on surface plants. The atmospheric biosphere also witnesses fascinating airborne journeys of spiders, also known as aerial plankton, carried by the wind, along with small insects. They form a crucial link in the food chain, serving as prey for birds and bats. 
Speaking of birds, they arguably represent the most impressive life forms in the sky, sailing at various altitudes with grace. Although their daily lives are closely connected to the surface for food, nesting, and breeding, they utilize atmospheric currents for migration. However, birds are often viewed as transient visitors to the atmospheric biosphere as their existence primarily aligns with the surface. As we climb higher, the density of life reduces, reflecting the increasingly harsh conditions. Thinner air, larger temperature swings, and increased exposure to UV rays gradually craft a more hostile environment. Nevertheless, recent research has detected bacteria even at these lofty heights, offering compelling evidence of life's astonishing adaptability. The exploration of the atmospheric biosphere broadens our understanding of life's resilience and its knack for exploiting diverse environments. This understanding highlights the variety of habitats life can master on Earth, and feeds the tantalizing prospect of discovering life elsewhere in the cosmos. Indeed, the sky isn't the limit for life, it's another frontier. The biosphere of our planet is a marvel within the universe. It represents a fragile, thin layer that stretches several kilometers above and below Earth's surface, enclosing every ecosystem where known life can flourish. Set against the vast, seemingly barren cosmos, the preciousness and rarity of our biosphere become strikingly evident. Understanding the nuances of Earth's biosphere is not merely an academic exploration in biology, geography, or atmospheric science. It transcends these disciplines, compelling us to comprehend our place in the universe and marvel at life's resilience and adaptability. All living entities, from tiny bacteria to the massive blue whale, exist within this incredibly slender slice of the universe, a delicate bubble of life clinging to a rock speeding through space. Moreover, the exploration of Earth's biosphere underpins our search for extraterrestrial life. By deciphering the conditions conducive to life on Earth, we construct a model to guide our hunt for life in the universe. We understand that life, as we know it, requires certain conditions like an optimal temperature range, availability of water, and the presence of specific chemical elements. This understanding directs our search for habitable zones beyond Earth. However, it's essential to acknowledge that our understanding of life is shaped by these models. Many conditions and parameters deemed essential are Earth-centric, mold by our planet's unique environmental conditions and evolutionary history. But could life elsewhere have different prerequisites? Could there be entirely alien environments with Goldilocks conditions vastly different from Earth's that are favorable for a completely different form of life? The exploration of our delicate biosphere prompts us to ponder these questions. It reminds us to remain humble in our assumptions and open to possibilities beyond our current comprehension. As we probe deeper into the mysteries of our biosphere and extend our search into the cosmos, we recognize that life, in its most universal essence, is far more diverse and adaptable than we ever imagined. Thus, scrutinizing Earth's life within its slender biosphere serves as the cornerstone for our extraterrestrial explorations. It provides the starting point for our speculations and scientific investigations about life elsewhere in the universe.